Welcome to this installment of Capstan Ag's video series. I'm Sam Marks, and today we will be learning how to check a coil or solenoid on your Capstan Ag system. This process will require a digital multimeter and the coils to be tested. Today we will go over how to properly diagnose a coil. This is a simple way to determine if your coil is bad or if your valve assembly may just be plugged. Solenoid failures are not a common issue, but they do happen every once in a while. Today, I will show you a quick and easy way to verify if a coil is bad or just plugged with debris. You'll need a common digital multimeter for this test. First, set your digital multimeter to read resistance or ohms. Then unplug your coil from your harness and insert your positive and negative probes into the terminals of your coil. Now a good coil should read between 21 and 24 ohms. Anything outside of this value is considered to be a bad coil. Notice that this coil would be considered a bad coil. If we check this coil with the same procedure, notice that this coil is within spec range. So this is considered a good coil. This is a quick and easy way to tell if your coil has gone bad or if you simply have some debris lodged between your coil and your through body. Now you've learned how to properly diagnose a coil. This is a quick and easy way to determine if it's a bad coil or if you have a plugged valve assembly. Thanks for learning with us today from everybody at Capstan Ag. For more information, contact our team at capstanag.com.